You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and check it out. I have a miniature soda dispenser and bank for Coca-Cola. I'm thinking this is from the 50s. It says, for boys and girls, hold six and a half ounces, and you see money kind of flowing into the little bank area, and then you tilt this little lever down and then dispense it into your cup. Let's turn the box around so we can kind of see all the sides. Pause and refresh. Drink Coca-Cola. Plastic dispenser and bank. Completely washable. And same thing on that side and kind of the same thing. Well, a little color more on the top. Miniature dispenser and bank. Have a Coke. And then the back tells you how to set it all up. So now you can kind of get an idea. Insert lever A in container, insert into slot, spreading sides and slide pins B into place. I read that all wrong, but you understand. And then you insert your bank into money slot and pull down to secure. So that's what locks it in place. C and G Toys, I believe that says Lions, Illinois. Like I said, I think it's from the 50s. That's kind of the way it looks for the age of the box. So what I'm going to do now is get it out of the box carefully, come back, and I will show you what it looks like. All right, so here we go. Before I actually dispense any pop, I want to show you how it all goes together and the pieces. So let me move these out of the way. You get two little Coke cups. Now, they don't say Coke, but they match the set, and I'll move those off to the side. They do eventually slide in here so you can dispense the Coke in there. And then it's hollow on the back. It does say pause and refresh, drink Coca-Cola, and then you've got these stickers on the side. Now, being entirely washable, I would say um, I would definitely not put those in water, but there you go. So that's what the back looks like. Now, you take this is your bank. So it doesn't hold a ton of change, but you put it here and then slide it down. So now that's locked in. And then this is a two-piece storage for your cola. So you pour your cola in there. You're putting it in here, and then you're locking it in, and then it's going to pour out into the cup from this little pour spout. So what they're saying was get this lever in place, and then get that pin in, and that pin in, and now I am good to go. So I put that down, and then it will fill and dispense Coke, and then I can put change right in here. So now you see how it works. Let me get some Coke. Let me fill it up. Grab some change and we'll test it out. All right, so we've seen how it works. I just need to fill it up with a Coca-Cola. Now, I decided to bring in three. I'm not sure. I think I'm going to do the Coca-Cola Cherry. So I'm going to move these out of the way for now. If I use them, I'm not sure. I might use them in another video. But I'm taking the Coca-Cola Cherry. Now, I'm going to turn this around. And then I'm going to take off this little lid carefully because it looks like it'll move. I should be able to pour it in from here. I'm not sure. Let's see. Let me bring this in a little bit closer here so that you can see it. And I did wash everything before I started. Okay, so that's set. Now I need to fit the little lid back on. Making sure. I'm going to hold that lever up on the side so I don't accidentally flip it over. Okay, so now that is ready. I guess I've just, since I've never used it before, a little worried I'm gonna spill. All right, now the bank side, you know, it's kind of small. So I don't think it's really meant to be a long time bank. You know, you just kind of put in your dime. Then you put your cup in. There you go. And then you turn this down. So I think if I put it all the way back, it should be good. There it goes. Don't overfill, all right. So my first Coke of cola is ready. Look at that. So that felt pretty good. Here, I'm going to drink it. Ah, refreshing. It's nice and cold. I just took it out of the fridge. Let me do another one here. And I will zoom in. And maybe I'll do it from the back so you can kind of see how it's working now that you understand the principles of the toy. I'm calling it a toy because I think it's definitely more for playing, not for, like, having a... Coca-Cola party like some of the other dispensers I've shown you. So I'm gonna pay I'm gonna pay a penny. That's all I want to pay for this next one. And I'm gonna dispense. Look at that. Ooh, almost went over. I moved too fast. 
It even has like the little tray in there where it will stay in there and collect. All right, let me turn this around now. So as you can see, a little different perspective here now. See it dripping? Okay, and here we go. I'd still say it's a fun little toy to play with. There. All right, that is my Drink Coca-Cola Pause and Refresh Mini Bank and Dispenser. Oh, I forgot to put change in here. I'll pay that one. I'm going to put a little bit extra change in there. And then I'll put another dime in there. Part of our pop dispensers and soda dispensers, I have some really cool ones that are coming up. And a big Pepsi series that's on the way. So if I want to take my money out, remember I just lift it up. There's my change, and I paid myself. And look in that description for a playlist, there's always you can just search. Lucky Penny Shop, hope you enjoyed this mini dispenser. Again, I think it's from the 50s, so that's what I'm dating it at. And I will uh, see you in the next video. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.